reason anyone my talk today is the two brothers. Have you seen the ghost? Actually, I had. When I was a little girl, I used to live in a house where my brother used to work as his office too. Even now, I already moved out, but I would like to share some stories with you. In my room, there's only an eye window, so it means there was no sunlight. And if you walk through the aisle, you can see everything I do in the room. I remember the first time I saw it very clearly and costly. I was nine years old. That day, I was reading my comedy book on my bed and in front of the aisle window. And later, when I was reading my comedy book, there was a white thing show up in the other side of the window. It was very short moment at a very short distance to me too. So I saw this that and I turned my eye to the thing. I almost saw there is a white thing with the green line. But when I totally raised my head, it disappeared. Sometimes I thought maybe it's my imagination. But when I was in junior high school, I saw it again. That, that night, I was playing my video game on my bed, and it is still in the same room. And uh, when I was playing my video game, there was something flying through the aisle. Sometimes I feel so unsecure when I was in the room. I'm afraid um, there will be one something or someone show up in my room. And finally, one day, my younger brother entered to my room without knocking my door. And he stuck around the door and say nothing to me for a moment. So I feel so strange. I ask him what's going on with you. He say, when he opened the door, he saw there was a boy around my older brother's edge and stay on my bed and look at me. And when he tried to figure out who is he, he disappeared again. Because um, I experienced that, so every layer is something all of the world. I lived in that house over 10 years, from the age of 9 to 20. Now the, the house is rebuilt to a tall building. And after I moved out, I hardly, almost not see, didn't, didn't see that things again. Actually, I saw the ghost mouth is a very good Chinese tradition because it teaches us to be generous, uh, to give it the food, to respect something we don't know, we cannot speak, and uh, respect them as uh, good brothers.